Police in New Jersey need help solving a deadly hit and run. The driver of a car fatally struck a motorcyclist and just kept going. It happened yesterday afternoon in Camden at Mount Ephraim and Sayers Avenues. Eyewitness News reporter Madeline Wright shows you the clue police say the driver left behind. Camden police are searching for the driver who fatally struck a motorcyclist and never even stopped to render aid. It's very important to find the driver responsible um, so we can determine um, what occurred and hold him responsible for, you know, his actions. The hit and run happened around 3.30 Tuesday afternoon. Police say the motorcyclist was driving north on Mount Ephraim Avenue while the car, similar to this one, was going south. The car then turned left onto Sayers Avenue, right into the path of the motorcyclist, who had the right of way. The vehicle involved um, is a 2000 to 2003 Nissan uh, Maxima Golden Color. Uh, missing its rear bumper. The bumper was left at the scene of the accident. Police say several drivers who witnessed the hit and run here called 911. The motorcyclist, identified as 41 year old William Cooper from Camden City, was rushed to the hospital where he was pronounced dead. My heart goes out to the family, um, uh, but I'm sure they will want closure and they want to know who, um, who struck their loved one. Police say even though the surveillance video they've obtained from the scene isn't very helpful, they do have substantial leads in the case. They're hoping to make an arrest soon. Anyone with information that could help the investigation is urged to call police. In Camden, Madeline Wright, CBS3 Eyewitness News.